to crack everyone, Jobber here, and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be popping open six of the brand new Hidden Arsenal Chapter 1 boxes sponsored by Konami. They mailed us six of these boxes, and we're popping open all of these in today's video, checking out the brand new Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and I cannot wait to see what is inside these epic little boxes. And if you enjoy this video, please remember to give this video a thumbs up, comment down below your favorite card you see in today's video, and hit the subscribe button, and the bell right next to us so you get notified for future videos. And without any further ado, let's get cracking. All right, so here they are. This box is absolutely gorgeous. This is what it looks like when it's standing up. And then you have a little side view here, which is really amazing. So there's gonna be some nice reprints in here, plus some new Yu-Gi-Oh cards. And I'm really excited about popping these things open. So yeah, the Hidden Arsenal Chapter One. Let's go and see what is inside box number one. Hopefully, there's going to be some really cool cards. I think there's going to be really cool. I was actually expecting like a uh, like a normal booster box. So these little mini boxes are really cool. I normally put like little goodies in here, and they're just really nice. All right, so let's see. Box number one. What do we have inside here? Oh, nice. That's a little way to keep keep all the cards safe. All right. All right, so nothing in that box. And let's see what we have here. Nice, so we have the an armed dragon. It's our nice promo right here. This thing is really, really beautiful looking. Oh my gosh, check that out. 2,800 attack, 1,000 defense. It has the exact same stats as a dark armed dragon. That is our first little promo card right there. And then we have a really cool looking dice right here. Very, very nice. What do we have here? That's a nice little transparent. That's cool. I really like that. All right, then we have our two booster packs right here, the Hidden Arsenal Chapter One. And then we have a little uh, <laughs> a little ice barrier guide right here. Let's go, I'm, gonna, I'm assuming it's gonna go through some of the combos of the Dragoonities that are in here, which is actually really, really nice right here. So it's like a little like a strategy guide, be able to go into some of the plays. Very cool. And let's pop open booster pack number one. So we have 18 cards per pack. That is really, really awesome looking. Check that out, first edition. Very cool. I don't know what kind of ratios are gonna have inside here or anything. I don't know if there's gonna be like a set foil or they're gonna do super ultra secret. I'm not exactly sure. So I'm really excited about checking this out and seeing what is uh, what the ratios will be. So it looks like we have, so we have three, four, five common so far. And we have the Naturia Pineapple, very nice. And a little, uh, Nice little reprint, actually. The Naturia Pineapple is originally a uh, secret rare. Oh, nice. We have the Naturia Barkion as our ultra rare. And a uh, Mystical Space Typhoon, which is actually a... What is that? Like a dual terminal. That's like a terminal ultra rare right there. You see those speckles on it. It's very, very cool. I really like that. And then we have a... Dragoonity Flanks, which is the same kind of foiling. Very, very nice. And then they have a common card like that. So this is like a, kind of like a, I would like to say dual terminal. Maybe it's like a, a terminal foil, terminal common. Very, very nice though. Very, very awesome. Okay, then we have the, the Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon right there, which is a nice little reprint. Very cool, I like that. So it's kind of like bringing dual terminal foils back. At least that's what it looks like to me. Gosh, that is beautiful looking. I really like that Mystical Space Typhoon. All right, so pack number two. Let's go and see what is inside here. That's really exciting. So there's like a little mix of uh, some of the old, some old cards and new cards in here, which makes it kind of exciting. Go through these commons again. So there's three foil cards and it looks like one, basically like a, a dual terminal common as well in these, which is uh, very cool. Goyo Guardian, very nice. A lot of Naturia love in here. You can see, oh my gosh, that is absolutely amazing. Oh wow, I had no idea. <laughs> that is awesome. So a, a a terminal ultra rare, a dual terminal. It's not, I don't think it's dual terminal, but like a, I don't know. I'm gonna call it terminal. Terminal ultra rare, dark magician. And that is absolutely stunning looking. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. And the blue eyes, white dragon in the same booster pack. So we got the dark magician and blue eyes, both coming out of the stone. My, one of my all time favorite arts of both of these cards. Oh my gosh, what a pack. 
What is our last one? And another flex. Nice. A second copy. Hopefully we get a third one in today's video. Very nice. And here's our Miss Valley Falcon right there. Very cool. <sighs> My goodness. What a way to start out this video. That is absolutely incredible. Gosh, check those out. Those are beautiful. Blue Eyes White Dragon and the Dark Magician. Very, very cool. We'll put those over here to the side. I'm actually gonna put all these uh, like dual terminal type foils right there. And this dice is really, really awesome. That is like a red, <laughs> red with like a neon green numbers on there. Very, very nice. And we'll move our strategy guide over here. And then we have, Oh, nice. And we have, so there's like a, some new armed dragon cars in here, as you can see. 1900 attack, 1400 defense. Not too bad. Uh, what is card destroys an opponent's monster by battle? Uh, you can spell someone one level five or lower wind monster from your hand or deck, except uh, armed dragon. And it cannot attack directly this turn. That is absolutely amazing. That is a great card. Oh my gosh. Wow. Put that right up there, and here we have our two more booster packs, and let's go and take a look and see what other goodies we will have in here. Alrighty, pack number, well I guess number, I was gonna say number one, but I guess te technically pack number three. Wing Kribo there, very nice. I love all the Kribo cards. Some more, it looks like a brand new Naturia right here. <laughs> Naturia Pumpkin, very cool. I love the, I love the Dragoonities, I love the Naturia deck. I think those, those are two of the funnest decks, and oh my gosh. Bringing back some classics right here and a new Terminal Ultra Rare Book of Moon. Wow, that is beautiful. A little combo very nice with this too. Putting one of your opponent's monsters face down, you can attack over it easier. In some cases anyway. Oh my gosh, check that out. The Dark Paladin as a Terminal Ultra Rare. Wow. That is beautiful. Gosh, absolutely stunning looking. <laughs> the alternate art, Palmerization. Oh my goodness. Dang, this set is absolutely incredible. I love it. I have a mix of new and the classic cards in here and in a brand new ultra rarity. I love it. Oh my gosh. So we have the Blue Eyes Dark Magician. You got a classic pulverization right there. That is so cool. And then the Dark Paladin as well. All right, let's move over to our second pack from our second box. So technically pack number four. And let's see what we have in here. As you can tell, there's uh, all, a lot of these cards here have been in previous Hidden Arsenal sets. We have the Dustrino there, it's a classic card. It came from uh, Phronic Guardian, way back, no, Phronic Guardian, uh, PSV. <laughs> oh my gosh. And we have a Nether Book of Moon, very nice. Oh my gosh, wow. So, uh, ultra rare Trishla in here. This is beautiful looking. Oh my goodness. And another blue eyes white dragon. Very nice. That was a good pack. So, blue eyes, Trishla, and a book of moon. And then we have our, our terminal buster blade right there. Another classic card. And then our two booster packs. And then our strategy guide right there. Looks like there's nothing else in that box. Oh, nice. Armory Arm as a uh, Secret Rare. Very beautiful looking. And then our two booster packs. Let's go and take a look and see what is inside. So go through these a little bit quicker. Don't want to pass anything that's new, though. Oh, and of course they would put red eyes in here. Why wouldn't you go, 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 we got a high five to that. That is absolutely amazing. So you have Kaiba's Yugi's and Joey's big power cards in here. That is incredible looking. Oh, this is a very, very nice little reprint right here. Very cool. Ultra right there. And then we have, oh, Naturia Cherries. This card was, uh, as a super, it's getting really, really expensive. So this is beautiful looking as a brand new ultra rare upgrade. Very nice. Man, not a single one of these booster packs is disappointed. I am really excited about this set. This is super exciting. All right, so to our second booster pack here, 
go through here. So yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of different hidden arsenal reprints are in here. We have the Elementary Hero Stratos in here. Very nice. The dragonfly. Ooh, a cyber dragon right there. That is beautiful. So that is the original art from Cybernetic Horizon, I believe it was. CRV. Cybernetic Revolution. Oh my gosh. I am forgetting my sets. I am. Uh, I need to brush up on this stuff. But uh, yeah, this is the original art. Came originally as a super and a ultimate rare. Absolutely beautiful looking. And Nidus Talent as a ultra rare. Very, very cool. Dang, I believe the highest rarity this thing came before was a championship pack super rare. I know it was super rare for sure. And then we have our fabled right here. Very nice ultra rare. Oops. And almost skipped over our common right here. So it's like a dual terminal type foiling to it. Very, very nice. All right, so on to box number four. Let's go and take a look and see what other goodies we have here. Oh, nice. A cool green dice right here. I really like that red and yellow one. They got the clear one, and we have the green one there. Very cool. All right, and this is our second copy of our Arm Dragon. They will put that right over there. And two more of these booster packs. Let's see. So we have a Buku, very nice. <laughs> cool uh, old school common card. And we got some more. So it's Fabled, Naturia. Oh, nice. Mistworm. This came as an originally. This came as a dual terminal way back when, as a uh, ultra rare as well. So that's very cool. Very, very beautiful looking. Oh my gosh. This is a really, really awesome fusion monster. You should check this thing out. Very awesome. Came as a secret rare as well. Oh my gosh. And Gunganir. Pang. This thing just has such a nice variety of cards in here. And we have Naturia Cliff. And we have some Elemental Hero love in here, too. Man, this set has like a little mix of everything, which is cool, especially for the, the classic players like myself. I really like that. And then you have that little mix of some of the newer things as well. And let's see. Oh, nice. Another Cyber Dragon. Very cool. So we have a second Cyber Dragon. I believe it was our third Book of Moon and our second Palmerization in here. Very nice. And there's our uh, our terminal card there. And there we go. We have a uh, transparent, like a like almost like a turquoise, like a blue dice here. So we have like a red, green, blue, and a clear one. And then a second copy of Armory Arm Secret Rare. Very nice. And let's move right into our booster pack, which are absolutely beautiful looking. Limited uh, Venturia cherries there on the top corner. Very cool. And we have Karibo, very nice, and, oh, nice. So there's also, uh, as you can tell, there's been some cool fabled cards here, and a Bryanic, beautiful looking ultra rare. And then I believe this is our third flanks, which is nice, because uh, if you're gonna play Dragoonies, you need to play three. And if you haven't played Dragoonies, you really should. That deck is an absolute blast, especially if you like Synchro Summoning. So <laughs> very, very cool deck. Now, a little strategy guide shows you some of the plays for the deck as well, which makes it even uh, a little bit easier for you to pick up some of the combos. And I'm sure there's videos as well you can find. Oh, nice. A Barrel Dragon as a Ultra Rare. Oh, my gosh. Check that out. That is a classic. Wow. That is beautiful. And then we have Dragoonity Ducks. Very, very cool. And Naturia Beast. It's the Ultra Rare right there. Very cool. This is beautiful looking. Very, very nice. All right. So let's move over to our sixth and final box. And then we'll do a nice little uh, recap here. And is this new? This is our second copy. Okay. So I got a couple of twos there. Very nice. And our last two booster packs. Let's go and take a look and see if we can go and pull maybe a second Dark Magician, which would be nice. Uh, another Red Eyes, maybe. Blue Eyes. Potentially some new cards in general. So I guess we will go through here a little bit slower and see what we can find. So I know we pull the place out of that, which is nice. Uh, Nether Cyber Dragon, very cool. So that is our third one. So that makes a nice little playset right there. Second copy here. And our third Pulmerization, very, very nice. I wanted to have three of these, so very cool. And this came, comes as a dual terminal or terminal as well. Very cool. So I guess every common you can get in here as a terminal. That's nice. 
to our final booster pack. Let's go and take a look and see what we have in here. So many Naturias. There we go, some Dragonities. And you have Stratos right there. Another Mistworm is our second copy. Oh, they put Lava Golem in here. That's nice. That'll make my friend very happy. He loves burn cards and Lava Golem. And then a, another Gunganeer. Very, very cool. And our last bit of our commons right here. So let's do a quick little recap here of all of our amazing goodies that we got in today's video, which was a, quite the pile, as you can see. Everyone else booster packs has three ultras in it, plus one terminal common, just like a dual terminal looking common, has like speckling on it. Very, very nice. So there's our red eyes right there, blue eyes, and a dark magician. So I'm going to put those down here because I think those are so iconic and beautiful looking. Wow. And then you have some really some nice little classics in here, things for your Dragoonity deck, even things for Burns. I caught me off guard. I'm really looking forward to watching some of the other content creators' videos on this set as well as seeing what cards they pulled because that is absolutely amazing. Oh my gosh, absolutely beautiful. So it looks like every single one of these are guaranteed the one promo secret rare. I'm I'm excited about seeing this Ultra and Night Assailant too. Very very nice. You got the Naturia Cherries, another Blue Eyes White Dragon right there, Trishla, our third Book of Moon. That was absolutely amazing. And then here are our Secret Rares. Obviously, we're going to have six here in total. These are so beautiful looking. Oh, my gosh. And that is it for today's video. Again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Give this video a like and comment down below your favorite Yu-Gi-Oh card you saw pulled in today's video. Hit that subscribe, hit that bell right next to you so you get notified when I post future openings. I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace and love, Jobber here. It's sad it out.